Hi friends, good morning. Today we are doing our morning circle a little bit different. We're not inside, we are outside because the weather has been so wonderful. So I wanted to come outside and enjoy it with Bonnie. So let's get her out of her box. Bonnie in the box, sit so still. Won't you come out? Yes, I will. Hi Bonnie, how are you? Hi friends. I hope that you all had a great weekend and were able to enjoy this weather. Wasn't it warm outside? It sure was. Okay, so for today, I'm going to do the calendar on our white erase board. I'm going to read you the day. Today is Monday, May 3rd, and the year is 2020. Okay, now take a peek outside. Let me know what the weather is. We're supposed to have a wonderful sunny week. So you should see some sun and maybe some clouds. Okay, I'll give you a minute to do that. And while you're doing that, I'm going to be writing down our wonderful word for us today. Okay. Okay. Now we're back. Our wonderful word is plant. Plant. A plant is a living thing that has roots in the soil. It has leaves, a stem, uh, maybe some needles on it. It cannot move like animals can. And um, a tree can be a plant. A bush can be a plant. Um, carrots, broccoli, those are all plants. I'm going to turn the computer. We're going to see a bunch of plants that Miss Elizabeth has in front of her house. They all have roots rooted into the soil so they cannot move and they are living things. Okay, so we have to remember all living things need food and water to keep on living. Okay, we're going to be learning more about that this week. But here I have my plant so a tree can also be a plant. We have a really tall tree right here, right in front of Miss Elizabeth's house. You see it? But usually when people say plant, they are talking about smaller plants that you may have inside of your home or some hanging plants that you have outside of your home. Okay, so that is our wonderful word for today plant. It's a living thing with roots, a stem, leaves. It cannot move, okay? And many things can be plants. Trees, bushes, carrots, cactuses. They are all plants, okay? So that is our wonderful word. Miss Diana has also made a video for you of some plants that she has in her backyard, and you'll be able to watch that video right after this one. Okay, let's learn our new letter of the week is P. We have uppercase P and lowercase P. Let's make the sound of P together. It's like a small puff of air coming out of your mouth. Good job, friends. Okay, now some words that begin with the letter P. P is for pig. P is for popcorn. P is for plant. P is for purple. P is for please. P is for purse. P is for pumpkin. Oh, pumpkins grow on vines. Vine is a plant. And P is for peanut. Okay? So that is our wonderful word. And that is our letter of the week. Bonnie says hello to you all. Okay? And here's our plant, our wonderful word, plant. Have fun today, friends.